Hey folks, Alex Tiersch here, director of AmSpot, coming to you today from wonderful, beautiful, scenic Marina del Rey, California. I'm at the Advanced Aesthetics and Cosmetics Dermatology um, Association's uh, meeting in Marina del Rey at the beautiful Ritz-Carlton. Here, take a look, guys. you got to see this. I don't know if you can see that, but... I mean, it's it's just spectacular. It really is. Good enough to allow me to speak at their conference uh, for the second year in a row. It's a great conference for any of you dermatologists who are in cosmetic in cosmetics. Um, I highly recommend you stop by. It's a great conference. But that is not the reason that I'm reaching out to you today. I'm a man of the people. Let's just put it that way. And I give our members what they want. That's just the bottom line. And I tell you, um, in order for me to properly serve the members of the American Med Spa Association, I was talking, I think, is maybe to my wife or to my uh, to my wonderful staff at AmSpa, and we realized I realized that although um, we know everything there is to know about uh, medical spa regulation, and and we're always here to help, um, you know, our, our our members and clients who who need help figuring out what's what's legal and what's not legal and who can do what and and, and those kinds of things. What I realized uh, and was pointed out to me was that although I'm very familiar with medical spas and I've been to 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 several. I really have been lagging behind in experiencing the full treatments. I guess you could say uh, I need to, as the director of the association, I probably should have some familiarity with what's actually happening when it comes to the the uh, the, the treatments inside um, inside a medical spa. So, I have endeavored to take a journey, under which I will. Uh, get some of these treatments done so that I can better relate to you, the people, my clientele, um, the members of the association, the people that make this association work. Um, we love you and there's nothing more than I want to be able to do than to be able to relate to you further. So, uh, first step was to receive a hydrofacial treatment from the lovely Candace at Hydrofacial. Thank you so much. Uh, Hydrofacial just became a member of AmSpa. They're going to be at our events this year at our boot camps. Come check them out. It's a wonderful, wonderful machine. Um, my skin was glowing, I have to say, and it was a, just it was just a delight. It was a delight. I mean, that was at the Face and Body Show in Chicago. However, I have decided to take the next step. I'm not sure if you can see, but in my advancing age, I am getting some wrinkles. And... Um, I've decided to get some Brotox. I never thought those words would come out of my mouth, but indeed they did. So, um, I'm getting Botox tomorrow morning. I, this, I've never had it before. I've never had a needle anywhere near my face. I've got, I've got questions. I don't know what's going to happen. Does the needle go into my skull? Um, does it go to the bone? Does it hurt? I'm sure it hurts. I have to admit I'm a little bit scared. I asked if I could be, you know, put under general anesthesia. Um, I was told no, but... Um, in any event, uh, out here in California, um, Dr. Sheila Nazarian practices, and she is absolutely one of my favorite people in the world. You may have seen her. She's all over Instagram. Um, she's got a huge following on Twitter, also been on E, uh, The Doctor's Show, Extra. She's made several appearances on The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. So I figure if it's good enough for, um, The Real Housewives, She's probably good enough for me. And the biggest thing is Dr. Nazarian is a huge, huge um, supporter of AmSpa. And she has been, from the beginning, um, totally bought into what we're doing. Uh, has been supportive of us. Has spoken at our events. So for that, we're ever grateful. But in any event, tomorrow morning, 8.45, I'm headed over to her office for some Botox. And because I'm a man of the people, I'm going to bring you along on this journey to see what happens. Um, when the director of the American Med Spa Association, who admittedly does not take care of his skin or his face at all, as you can see, I haven't even shaved in several days. What's going to happen? I don't know. I'm nervous. I'm scared. But I'm going to I'm going to film the whole thing so you can see it. So stay tuned. Um, I'm I'm not sure what else to say. Um, so stay tuned. Uh, I'll talk to you soon. By the way, uh, support Am Spa. We love you guys so much. Thank you so much for all your support. Things are going wonderfully, and we've got lots to come. So so stay tuned.